And the answer to this question, does everyone have a twin flame, is very simple. No, they do not. Twin flames are extremely rare. You think there's 8 billion of us on the earth at any one time. And if we consider all the souls alive during this experience, those numbers go up even higher and make the twin flames even rarer. Whether you believe there's a set number of twin flames, as some do, and the number they set is 144,000, we have to accept that there are very few of us. If you spent any time in around the twin flame community online, you obviously think that we're all twin flames. It's quite normal and natural and we all speak about it and everyone is part of a twin flame relationship. But if you look at a thousand people who are not online and you start to think about or talk about twin flame relationships, very few will recognise it. So it is very, very rare. It's become more known, more talked about in recent years than in the past. So it's likely that some of your some of the people you know, your friends, might know about it. And it might be that we're tuning into that possibility of having a twin flame, that we are becoming aware of and being able to attach the language to it. But likely most people, when they talk about a twin flame relationship, what they have is a soul buddy of some sort, but not a twin flame, a very different kind of, you know, soul mate, as they might call it, a very different kind of relationship. So... Who knows what numbers of twin flames exist out there, but it's not everyone. Not everyone has one and not everyone can connect with their twin flame. So it's not about core numbers. It's about that meeting. And one of the things to remember here is that if you are one of a twin flame, you do not necessarily have to go looking for your twin flame. If that connection exists, that connection, that energy will find you and you will know that you are one of a twin flame. The next obvious question is, does everyone meet their twin flame? And again, the answer here is no, they do not. Partly because they're unaware of their existence, partly because they are not ready to meet their twin flame in this situation or at this time, and partly because there are many more factors around the availability of that twin flame, if you like, incarnation of that twin flame. So you can make spiritual contact, and but in some cases, making 3D contact may just be impossible to achieve because they are not incarnated at the same time in the same space as you are. Not all the souls in this world are present incarnated in our form and if you accept that then you must accept that your twin flame or a twin flame may be present as a soul but not incarnated in human form at the same time so in some senses in energetic terms you can meet your twin flame that twin flame can be as present for you as a physical presence but it may not ever be a 3d contact It's likely that when we think about human experience terms, not all of us making that 3D contact, some of us won't even be consciously aware of making spiritual contact at all, in fact. It depends on the level of spiritual growth and development achieved by both parties and many other factors. So it's not clean cut that everyone, yes, we can say yes, everyone meets the twin flame. I'd like to say yes, they do but it's actually more likely that you won't meet your twin flame during this experience in heat in 3D than it is that you will meet them. And that's okay. The beauty of that soul bond is that you have lifetimes upon lifetimes of chances to connect and that eventually you will connect. So if you're a twin flame, then spiritually speaking, you have a twin flame out there somewhere. But how you define that world notion has a big influence on that outcome. You might define the world as a world of human beings which are part of the human experience at the same time you are and that might limit your capacity to meet on a 3D basis. Your twin flame might have an experience in some other form as we've already said and that doesn't make your spiritual connection any weaker and it doesn't hold back the progress your soul is making 
towards meeting your twin flame. A twin flame will eventually meet their soul. Or perhaps your twin flame ends a human experience while they're still active in theirs. And again, the connection isn't any weaker or slower or held back by being in different realms because that connection, that soul bond remains. Timelines are so interesting when you add them into this conversation about twin flames. Consider the world from, say, a thousand years ago. If one twin flame was born into some remote village somewhere and a jungle, another was born another content, they might have felt that the twin flame is somewhere out there but worlds away. Now that world has closed in for us. How we perceive the world is so subjective. In these times, it is more likely that we will understand that our twin flame exists and our belief will carry us forwards in that that meeting, that 3D meeting, is so much more possible. In asking the question, does everyone have a twin flame? In part, what we're really asking is, do I have a twin flame? Because everyone has one, do I have one? You've been answered. The answer is no, not everyone has a twin flame. You will know if you do because of that soul connection. You will feel that pull. You will not have to go and search for it. It will find you. You will feel that pull, that soul pull. You'll feel something missing and slowly that will be being filled up by communications, by synchronicity, by physical touch, by dreams, by a sense that someone is there. And you will begin to accept that and you will begin to work with that soul flame journey towards your own spiritual growth and towards spiritual union. You will absolutely know if you have a twin flame. When you meet this twin flame in 3D, you will be able to confirm if that is indeed a true twin flame because of the unconditional love that will be present and because of the way in which that twin flame works with you toward your spiritual growth, towards union on the very same plane as you, towards that acceptance of you and acceptance of each other and acceptance of that twin flame relationship. All of the synchronicities, all of the familiarities, all of the touches, everything will signal to you that you are indeed inside a twin flame relationship. And this is what matters. What matters is you and your twin flame. I care about your twin flame journey. So let me help you. Let me guide you on that journey. Just click the link below.